cheese and it's just that bees and a pick from the back. I got a man, but you're fucking around. I got a man, but I'm fucking around because I'm young and I can't be tied down. Oh, baby, just to get down. They got a girl, she got nothing on me, but we wait. Hello, hello, welcome back to my channel. So I'm doing a quick Amazon haul. Um, these nails will be up soon. I am currently editing this video and I have been back to work. Um, so they are looking quite busted and old and they're grown out. So I'll be doing a fill on these soon. Please excuse Lily as she can't help herself. Excuse you miss. Um, I'm sorry if you hear the dishwasher in the back. Um, look i'm home i'm trying to get these videos out now that i'm a lot more stable and actually in a place where i can film so i'm happy about that um so yeah bypass all of the all of the disclaimers oh gosh um and yeah let's just get right into this amazon haul so the first thing i got was this two set of um this two set of what are these little jewel charm things? What are they? Nail art palettes, that's what they are. So I got a two pack of nail art palettes. Um, so I can have one for home and one for work. That way I can stop painting on the back of my acrylic tops. Um, and I do wanna apologize for this as well. I'm trying a new phone stand setup. That way I can keep recording for you guys. And it's just a little bit easier and smaller and out of the way, especially when I have clients. So. Let me know how you guys feel about this. I hate that it's in the video, but I haven't found a better solution yet that I actually like and actually can stay in frame. So um, let me know how you guys feel about this. But yeah, um, I just ordered this two pack and on to the next one. So the next thing I ordered was this three pack and it has a cuticle bit. I'll take the top off for you guys for the reflection. It has this cuticle bit, that way I can try this out. Uh, I was really intrigued. I normally use a circle bit. I normally use this cuticle ball bit or I use a cuticle carbide bit like this. I have one that is a little bit um, rougher since this one is a little older. Um, that I got from Young Nails. I don't know if I posted that haul, but yeah, I got a brand new one from them from this, uh, of this bit, but I don't, this is my old one, this came in a regular set. So that's normally what I use, but I notice sometimes, um, the edge tends to leave a little bit of a ring of fire. Um, it is also due to proper in use. Um, whether it's too much pressure or too high of a speed. So I'm figuring that out, but I wanted to have another option because no one wants to be giving their clients nail damage when you're supposed to take care of their nails. So, yeah. The other two bits that came um, in that set was this brush bit. I'm gonna try that out instead of using Swipe, um, which was another one of my nail orders, um, one of the other items in this nail order. So. Um, I'll talk a little bit more about that. So I'm gonna, I'm interested to try this. And then this is just a tornado bit. And I got this in a medium. Um, the other one was in a medium as well. Actually, it doesn't have a size because it's just, oh, it is. So this one is a medium as well. It's just a tapered one. But yeah, I wanted to try this to see if it was better for getting into the cuticles like here. Um, just for like finish shaping and filing um, to kind of cut down my time. So I got this in a medium. I had it in an extra course, on extra extra course. I ended up like almost ripping my freaking nail off. So yeah, had to go. I was not a fan of that. I think I'm going out of audio. Please, please don't mind me. The next one I got was this Panna one. And that is this diamond bit that is rounded at the top. So again, figuring out what figuring out which bit I like better um, for cleaning up the cuticles and getting into that area there. And that's just what this looks like. And this is a diamond bit. Again, this is from Panna. And of course, I will have all the links in the description below. The next one I got was an extra course. Oops, sorry guys was an extra course um, 
small barrel. So I wanted something smaller that I felt like I would have more control over. I should put those down. That I have more control over and so I would be able to um, better use it without damaging my client's nails. And it is a safety bit due to the rounded top and it does an extra course, which I like. So I know what bit is what, especially as they wear down and it's time to replace them. And the last bit is, I believe another Panna um, bit, but this is just a medium. I have one that I use currently, um, and I'll do a video on all of my nail, um, my drill bits that I use. So uh, this one I got in a medium and just to kind of have a, another one. I have a couple of fine, but I wanted another medium. That way I'm not always relying on just one bit. The next thing I got were these McCart nail files and they are washable. These are more so for at home use. The ones I had, um, they were just dull from me using them. And so it's nice to use a fresh file and they're purple which matches my brand and i love that and the last thing i got i might have to kind of zoom out for i'm sorry for the weird like bubble angle and the last thing i got was this young nail swipe and this is just to replace my other bottles so I bought the two pack of their um, regular swipe. It comes in eight ounces. And so I bought this one while it was on sale. So I got this one and bought a, and got another one for free. So I got a two pack. So I have one at my station at work and then one for home. And of course this is my home table in case you guys didn't know. Um, and so this will let me be able to refill both of those twice. And I believe it was $25, so I felt like that was a great deal considering I got this one on sale and it was only, I think like 10 bucks. It was either like eight or 10. Um, so I was really happy about that. And that's pretty much all I got. Thank you guys so much for watching. And of course, I will have links to everything um, down below in the description box. Um, like I said, let me know how you guys feel about this stand kind of in the way. Yeah, I'll change it so look back to normal. Um, let me know how you guys like the stand kind of in the frame. I'm not a huge fan of it, so I am working to find something better. But in the meantime, let me know what you guys think. Um, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.